Welcome back, guys. Uh, let's continue. Ah, it's good to see you again. How have you been doing? I have renounced the old gods. Really? What made you do that? I had a vision. The sleeper talked to me. What did he say? He said, go to the camp in the swamp and join the Brotherhood. You're a very rich man, stranger. The sleeper doesn't reward many people like that. <sighs> the sleeper has chosen you. Do you really want to join us? Yes, I wish to follow the sleeper. Go to Kor Kalom. Tell him I sent you because you are a true supporter of the faith. Tell me what do you want. What do you know about the weed? Well, the weed's grown in the swamp. Of course it has to be processed before it can be smoked. That's what we novices do. The weeds have a tranquil we I think we already did this. What can you tell me about the the sleepers, a divine creature. He causes visions, at least to the good and you May the sleep. Yeah, looks like uh, that doesn't go away if you want to listen to it again, I guess. So let's go to call Kra Kalam. Uh, it's kind of hard to pronounce. Maybe it isn't. I don't know. There is a guy here. What are you doing here? I'm teaching the words of the sleeper to the novices. I'm still a novice myself, but soon I'll be a Baal, one of the gurus. I've even spoken to Iberian. He's the chosen one. He told me that if I work hard, I can soon be a master myself. But I'm still putting that off. There's no rush, you understand? I can still become a master anytime. At the moment, I'm quite happy about my current task. You shouldn't believe everything. What's your task here? I test the new substances developed by Kor Kalam in his alchemy lab with my pals here. His aid gives us something new every couple of days, and we test it. This weed opens your spirit. If you take the right amount, you can get in touch with the sleeper. Have you ever been in contact with the sleeper? No, not yet. But that's because we never get enough of the stuff. Kalam always wants to hear about the effect of it, but I get the impression he's not really interested in my opinion at all. If I find the stuff stimulating, he passes it straight on to the gurus. But soon, I'll be a guru myself. Then I can go right to my limits and listen to the voice of the sleeper myself. I'd like to join your camp. Can you help me? You want to join us? That's good. Just wait. Yes, I think I can help you. I'm not a guru yet, but I have some influence in the Brotherhood. You'd have to do me a favor. Have you seen Fortuno yet? Then go. See him and collect your daily ration. If you leave me all the swamp weed he gives you, we're in business. I'll think about it. I have swamp weed on me. You can have it. Good. You must have noticed that none of the gurus wants to talk to you. You can change that by impressing them. I can tell you how to do that. How can I impress the gurus? Balkadar instructs the novices in the magic of the sleeper. If you want his attention, use magic. But don't give him the fist of win. Send one of his audience to sleep or something like that. Bal Namib is over there at the main gate. He's one of the toughest guys. I think Lester might be able to help you with him. Speak to him as soon as his master is away. The other gurus are basically quite okay. Just try to make yourself useful. Thanks for the advice. Hey! A deal's a deal! How can I impress the gurus? Bal Kadar instructs the novice if you want his attention, but don't get Bal Namib is over there. The other gurus. Thanks for. Hey! How do I get at the magic of the sleeper? 
Balkadar sells runes and spell scrolls. That's no use to you if he doesn't talk to you, right? Maybe another guru can help you. Let's talk about some. Okay, so we have uh, to find uh, a spell to use on uh, this guy here, or actually on his novices, to be precise. And we have to speak to some other guy who can give us that, but I'm not sure who was it. I know that some guy will give us the spell. You don't look like one who submitted to slavery under the Ore Barons. You look more like a seeker. Someone who's searching for the true faith. Do you not feel a fire inside your body which keeps you from sleeping at night? I see. You doubt that what the Ore Baron slaves try to tell you is really true and just. You know why you doubt them too? They're lying. With those lies, they try to control weak spirits. But your spirit is stronger than their lies. Don't you feel a longing for freedom every single day? Don't you feel it growing stronger? It guides your spirit. Let it happen. Do you know what you're doing when you try to suppress it? You're denying your soul, denying yourself. Don't let your fears dominate your life. Free yourself. You need to understand. The sleeper will awaken. He will set you free and wash away all these disbelieving infidels. Like dross that is washed away by the rain, they will vanish from this world. They will moan, whine, and repent. But it will be too late. Then they will pay the price. They will pay with their blood and with their lives. Hey, you've spoken to me. Does that mean I may talk to you now? I see you've become familiar with our rules. That's good. I can feel your great spiritual strength. Soon you'll be allowed to join our community. I have spoken to you because I wanted to give you a chance to prove your loyalty. How can I prove my loyalty? Most of all, we need new souls to join our community. By recruiting one more man to our camp, you will prove that you're willing to do good service to our community. Where can I recruit new members for the Brotherhood? The old camp is a good place to try since a lot of the people there are fed up with fear and lies. They just need some kind of support. I guess you won't be very successful in the new camp, the men living there are barbarians. Where can I- The old- Why are you so desperate for new members? The sleeper has spoken to our master, revealing that he has an important message for us. However, he has not gathered full strength yet. That's why he needs our strength to contact us. Therefore, we are preparing a great invocation. And the more men participate, the likelier we are to be successful. If you want to know more about it, go to the large court in front of the Temple Hill. But don't disturb our master in his meditations. Let's talk about something I'm not listening else. Listening to all the blabbering anymore. Rely on yeah. People always talk. I've come to collect my daily ration. Here. I want what? It was obvious that there would be trouble. Thought that had been cleared up ages ago. Rely on somebody, and you're in trouble. You shouldn't believe That's everything you hear. Now, there was a time when things would have gone. 
Some people never. Let's talk about something else instead. There was a time. That's really not my. It was obvious that there'd be trouble ahead. But keep it to yourself. People. Let's talk about something else instead. What do you want? I think I have convinced the Baals. Baal Nabib is convinced that I'm a true believer. And? That was it. You're wasting my precious time. Come back as soon as four of the Baals consider you worthy. What kind of... My research takes place... I'll be seeing. May the... Hmm. Who was it that has that spell? Maybe the guy that told us I about like the spell can give us if we give him more swamp weed. Or somebody Hang else. On. We can also try a Lester. That's uh, always that's a good a idea. See, we can make this ball speak to us. So he definitely won't speak directly to us, but maybe if we find somebody here... It was obvious that there would be trouble. Some it's not that guy, I guess. It was obvious that there would be trouble ahead. Well, we'll try a Lester. Yeah, that uh, sky is a bit weird. There is an option that can make it look a tiny bit better. But you cannot really apply it all the time. Hmm. I really want to also explore. Well, let me show you that uh, trick for getting the sky to look a bit better. Oh, I didn't delete the, the save games from the previous one. Doesn't matter. I will go over the previous episode. Mm. Okay, so control F11. And uh, then uh, uh, let me see for sky. Um, there is a checkbox here. And my game just went into window mode, so I will have to reload. Okay, so there it is. I was looking for it. I don't know if uh, it makes it look better. It, but it looks also looks tiny bit weird. But maybe it's better. Not sure if we tick the apply. Will it then uh, kind of... But oh, this is for shader macros. Maybe that will save it. I'm not sure. But I think it looks tiny bit less weird. Even though the horizon looks a bit... Actually, we can't see as far now. I think. I don't know. I think it looks tiny bit better. And the rendering distance also, that's on F11, we can crank that up. Also this kind of makes it a bit more foggier and also renders more stuff in the distance. I think 5 or 6 is a good number. But yeah, in some cases it will look a bit weird, maybe if I kind of crank my camera downwards it'll look better Maybe. I don't know if I made it worse you everything you hear. with uh, enabling this People always nah, that, that didn't screw anything but yeah, the distance is
it's kind of a trade-off. I don't know if it's better or not. I would be happy to play it even without the X11 mode. Huh. <sighs> okay, so this guy won't talk to us. Um, but recording it without the X11 mode is kind of tricky, so that's why we are with the X11. I know a few more tricks on tweaking there, some stuff, but I think it's pretty okay. And if I can, if I think of something that's more useful, I will tell you. Uh, oh, there's a, this guy with the name. Hi, you aren't from this camp, are you? Well, now I am. I left the old camp a week ago. Told my pal Dusty to come along, but he wanted to wait. I know Dusty. I talked to him for a short time. If you meet him again, tell him that he was dumb to stay there. It's ten times better than getting harassed by the guards in the old camp. I'll tell him if I see him again. I doubt that's ever likely to change. How do I get at the magic of the sleeper? Balkadar sells runes and spell scrolls. That's no use to you if he doesn't talk to you, right? Maybe another guru can help you. It was well, the other guru is that one that uh, told us to recruit, or this guru will talk to us. May the sleep. I think we'll have to recruit that uh, guy from the old camp uh, for uh, to proceed further because once we recruit him, I think that other guy might give us the spell, and then we can impress that other guru, and everything will kind of daisy train from that point onwards. So the game kind of. Well, it pushes you to go to one camp, then the other, and uh, then get back. I don't know how many meat we have. <laughs> Probably a lot. Let me see, so we don't do this for forever. Yeah, we did 100, we have 114 more. Now nah, we'll, we'll continue a bit later on. Like, uh, you can uh, crank up the render distance uh, to the max, but that's not going to render everything. I think it actually will render everything, but it doesn't help if you go over 60 or so, I don't know, 65, doesn't do much because the game itself has a kind of radius around the character for render distance, and uh, even if you crank up the other things, it's not really helping. So, yeah. Hope that's uh, useful information. And sometimes looks better, sometimes look looks worse. In distance there. I don't know what we, would help. Uh, also, these uh, graphics. Oh, visual range. I know, something was off. Yeah, that is why it's being weird, I think. But maybe we need to reset the game. Since that's weird, maybe some other thing is weird. Nope. Also, uh, increase the sample rate to 44 uh, for better quality sound. Well, I don't know. We did get into this forest. Maybe I should use 
this save, I guess. I don't know. Or start using the empty ones. Oh, that's a Shadow Beast. Uh, we, we left him alone. Maybe we can try that hill there. Kinda wondering, is that the thing that I was messing with before? And when I do this, you cannot see that on the recording, but I end up messing up my game, it flickers and uh, it's in a window mode. I think I can finish the episode like this, but yeah, like screwing with that's generally not a good idea during recording. I don't remember what was uh, after this bridge, but I think we'll end up uh, somewhere there where we shouldn't be. I think there's a temple here or something like that. Is it when I go like this, the rend it renders stuff when I go like this, it kinda looks weird. Very weird. I really wish I could make it look better. So this is what I turned on. I guess I will leave it off to see. Yeah, that screwed things up. <laughs> okay, uh, let's apply. You have to kind of test these things out and maybe, maybe you make it look better, but you're probably better off with defaults. Uh, maybe just crank up the render range and uh, that other thing that I did. Enable dynamic shadows. I just hope I won't get any tearing in the game because I'm in uh, window mode. Uh, I don't think we should be here. And maybe we cannot even enter it. When she's jump, yeah, this is for the next chapter. Like they said, I, I played the game really a long time ago. Well, I remember some stuff, it's a pretty uh, detailed game, it has lots going on. And I decided to explore every corner, if I'm not sure about something, I will explore it so you can see if I know something in advance. I, if it's not a spoiler in terms of uh, quests and stuff like that, I will tell you guys about it. If it's a spoiler, I will keep my mouth shut, as always. Oh yeah, some lizards. It's a saved game on the empty slot. I think we need to train even more for this to work properly without us missing this much. I think actually this is not a great idea. Because 
because we don't do as much damage as it's required to get those kills easily. I think I will leave them alone for now. And focus on some small fry enemies. Don't remember what was over this bridge. I think it's also some kind of temple or something like that. And those are black goblins. Uh, maybe. Maybe. But we'll do that uh, once we go back from the old camp back to the new back to the um, uh, swamp. So we will do that then. But then we'll have that guy coming with us, maybe. I'm not sure if he he will go by himself or we have to escort him. Hmm. Either way, I will have to think of some strategy to kill those goblins because they give lots of XP. And I also want to grab a newer, even better bow, and that is in the, the mines. And I think we... Uh, did we drink that thing? Yes, we did. We have 18 dexterity and I think that should be enough uh, for equipping that bow. I think it's exactly 18 and it does a bit more damage than the one that we found. I didn't know about this bow, but I did know about that other bow. So, um, we got that uh, recipe, so let's deliver that first. Let's talk about something. I doubt that's Why does that I think that this guy. Okay, my game is lagging a bit here, so we'll end the episode here and I can restart the game in the meantime. So, guys, uh, thanks for watching and see you in the next one.